Hello Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out what does your person on your mind right now secretly want to say to you. To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. And today is the 6th of May, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 10.34 a.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. If you were to finally guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same sign. All right, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn, the person on your mind right now. What do they secretly want to say to them? Another one's at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so the person in your mind right now secretly would like to say to you that they are scared. But two of cups, they feel that both of you belong with each other. Both of you are compatible with each other. They are starting to realize that with the tower here. And in Nine of Swords, here is a similar verse. There is no doubt whatsoever in their mind that you are the one for them that both of you belong with each other however the nine of wands in my verse the death here indicates a big change they secretly want to say to you that they're contemplating in regards to changing their old behavior or starting to settle down if you look at the nine of wands in my verse it's up in the air right it's in reverse. Obviously, it's not grounded. It's not stable in and out energy. We've got the Seven of Pentacles. So this is like straight away grounding um, because this is on the ground. And also the Pentacles, it's, a, it's an earth energy. So they have been secretly with the Seven of Cups here actually thinking, thinking a lot in regards of finally grounding for you, for this connection. I hope that makes sense to you. Um, I secretly want to say to you that there are so many options, but they know you are the one for them. But at the same time, with the death here indicates it's going to transform their life, who they are, or who they've been for a while. For um, It's going to change, it's going to transform dramatically look at the tower, or drastically who they have been for a while. Maybe this is someone who is afraid of commitment, nine of wands, afraid of getting hurt. Maybe they've been hurt before. So they secretly want to say to you that they are contemplating ending their past behavior, who they were as a person for a while. Because the death is a big card, it's a major card. So it feels like maybe this person has been a certain way, however they could have been, yeah, uh, single or a certain behavior that they were used to. Um, that has to end. And they basically want to say to you that they may want to end that part of them and then perhaps settle down Seven of Pentacles and invest in you, in this connection, and we've got the Queen of Wands here, they secretly want to say to you that they are crazy attracted to you, you know, the tower, you are the bomb, you are it, they are insanely, insanely attracted to you, but Seven of Cups, Hangman, they've been pondering about who they are, who they have been again for a while, and being with you means something has got to die, as I'm not saying literally, like a part of themselves that have been themselves for a while has to die. Perhaps 
if they were to continue being who they were, who they have been for a while, then this connection wouldn't work out, right? So this is what I'm seeing here. Hmm. Secretly want to say to you that they dream about you, and they daydream about you, mm. and they've been observing Seven of Pentacles, trying to see or trying to get to know you even better, trying to, again, observe to see if, if, it, if this investment is worth it, because the Seven of Pentacles is going to get investment, if this investment is worth it investing in you investing in this connection is it worth it is it worth for them to make this huge transformation this big change for you right however if this is someone you're separated from this is another version take what resonates with you they basically want to say to you that they are still hurt but they're okay um the tower here indicates the way things ended was very abrupt or it just was a shock to their system. They secretly want to say to you that they want to see you again. But they don't know if, with the tower here, that it's possible. Maybe the damages were done in such a big way that they fear that, 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 that there's nothing that they can do about this, that you wouldn't want to reconcile. And the death here indicates that maybe they secretly want to say to you that maybe this is it, this is the end, there's no coming back to this, right? Maybe you're not interested in them anymore and that you can actually do better than them because the Knight of Wands is in reverse, while the Queen is a Queen and it's in the right position. Secretly may want to say to you that they still find you to be very attractive or even attractive now, even more attractive now than before. See, there's a realization here. They basically want to say to you that they've realized the power that you have you have on them or just how powerful you are, even after the ending. It's, it feels like this energy where there are some regrets in regards of not... Um, believing in you, not having faith in you. And we've got these seven of pentacles here. Basically, want to say to you that what has happened to this connection, I thought two of cups, that we were good, everything was good. And then just, it just ended. It just ended just like that, right? And the seven of cups, and then the hangman here. They basically want to say to you again that they do dream about you. They do wonder what had happened between two of you, what has gone wrong. They daydream about you. They could also be thinking about all the sacrifices you have made for them. All, everything that you have invested on them. And that they didn't see that until now. Because the tower here, it's them realizing it. So I really want to say to you that both of you could have been really good for each other, right? Again, two of cups. That feelings were mutual. If you love them as, uh, this much, they love you this much as well. Um, whether you believe it or not, yeah. They may also secretly want to say to you that perhaps this break was needed or this ending had to happen because somebody with the Seven of Cups here was still not, and also the Knight of Wands here, whatever, someone is still not, was not, was still not ready, even though they were not ready, but didn't mean that they didn't love you. They still do love you. They may secretly want to say to you that they, there have been some other options that they were presented with but none of them can compare to you because some of the cards can indicate a lot of options but not all options are good and they've just been waiting for the for they could be waiting for you yeah waiting for you or waiting for someone who is like you but it has been taking a long time because again so pentacles right taking a long time they've been searching for somebody to replace you but none of them can replace you okay let's see more yeah i really want to say to you that they long for you not a cups they've been on their own they've been doing their own thing 
um, now they don't really feels like they're not ready they're single yeah feels like even if they're with somebody right now they are they still have this mentality where they are single because they still don't think whoever they are with now or the, all of these options are good enough for them and three of wands they could still be waiting for you the moon in my first five swords in my first five of wands they secretly want to say to you that every day is a battle every day is them hoping for a reconciliation hoping that this tower moment didn't happen things didn't go awry between the two of you secretly want to say to you that they've made a mistake with the fool here in my verse please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and this person okay yeah this experience has changed your person because again two major colors yeah you change them in a very big way um they secretly want to say to you that they're remaining single or if they're with somebody it's not serious um they're realizing that both of you should have been with each other should have been together all right Virgo, taurus capcom this is your reading i hope you resonated in some way shape or form <clears throat> i have a sore throat right now mm. but anyway if you resonated don't forget to hit like share and subscribe i'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my other channel, my travel channel. Just posted a short yesterday. Yeah, check it out if you want. I'm going to leave it on the screen right now. You can click on it. It takes you straight to that channel. All right. Take care. Hope to see you back here again uh, sooner than later. <laughs> Bye.